In Ecuador, 35% of the population live in multidimensional poverty. The index on the prevalence of chronic malnutrition is 24%. Women receive on average 22% less salary than men. Thirty percent of the population do not have access to drinkable water. The underemployment rate in March 2017 was 21%. The total deforestation between 2013 and 2017 has been 220,000 hectares. If these figures already seem worrying at the national level, consider that the situation in some provinces of the country is even worse. With the aim of tackling these problems, which are repeated on a global level, the leaders of 193 countries came to an agreement in September 2015. The 2030 Agenda, together with the 17 Sustainable Development Goals. This agreement contains 169 targets and 241 indicators and recognises the importance to start fighting against poverty, caring for the planet and decreasing inequalities. The 17 goals are all interconnected and interdependent and fulfilling them is a question of survival and joint responsibility of all citizens. In this context, the Fundación Futuro Latinoamericano, together with Grupo Faro, are implementing the project SDGs Territory Ecuador, which is financed by the European Union and lasts three years. The project is being carried out in five provinces, Santo Domingo, Galapagos, Manabí, Napo and Asuay. The project SDGs Territory Ecuador seeks to contribute to the continued improvement of the conditions and livelihoods in the country through the performance of the SDGs. It aims for their incorporation in national and local public policies and strengthening the civil society and the local government in their implementation and monitoring. Reaching the SDGs will be easier if we all get involved. Governments, public institutions at all levels, social organisations, academia, the private sector and more generally all citizens. We all share the responsibility to take care of the planet on which we live.